November 15, 1967. Police discover an abandoned car beside Old Alton Bridge, five miles south of Denton, Texas. A rash of mysterious disappearances are becoming alarmingly routine on a chilling stretch of road that is known by locals as the Goatman's Bridge. Constructed in 1884, the bridge connected Louisville to Alton. The turn of the century brought a black goat farmer and his family to a residence just north of the bridge, and a few short years later, Oscar Washburn was known as a dependable, honest businessman. North Texans endearingly began to call him the Goat Man. But the success of a black man was still unwelcome, and Klansmen and the local government turned to violence after he displayed a sign on Alton Bridge, this way to the Goat Man's. One night in August 1938, with their headlights off, the Klansmen crossed the bridge, dragged the Goat Man from his family, and lynched him over the side. Peering over into the water, his murderers saw a rope, but not his body. In a panic, the Klansmen returned to the Washburn residence and killed his family in cold blood. Since the disappearance of the Goat Man, there have been many strange sightings on and near Old Alton Bridge. Some say his spirit still haunts these woods. Locals tell the story and follow it with a warning. Those who cross the bridge with no headlights will be met on the other side by the Goat Man. After numerous abandoned vehicles and missing persons, a new bridge was constructed directly downstream, but Old Alton Bridge, the Goatman's Bridge, remains still open to foot traffic. It is under surveillance by the Paranormal Investigators of North Texas and the Denton County Paranormal Investigators. Oscar Washburn was never seen again and has been presumed dead since his attempted murder.